Okay, so I need to add, I really need to tell you guys about something. Well, back in 2014, I was collecting, well, Trackmaster 2 models and the plate and the sets. Wondering. And, well, well, I don't have any problems, but it's just that, well, I mean, there are some good sets, like the, uh, Spiral set, and the Percy and Harold High Flying Avengers set. Well, there are a lot of errors and, well, problems with these models. Well, I mean, the original was just fine. Well, it was good and great. So was Playrail. It was great. So it was also great, but, um, though, to be fair, I, there are some things I don't really like, and, well, I don't like the front and back wheels. They're not good, and they can wobble at times. Plus, 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 I don't really like them. I might have to swap them out with the Tommy or Trackmaster wheels. One wheels. Maybe if I get the chance, but that could be a bit of a problem, and I don't know when I'm going to do that. So, yeah. Though, it's just that. I might have to replace the wheels and the couplings, but the couplings are are also another problem, but I mean, I might have to replace these at some point, so yeah, and well, I mean, I, I mean the only real re reason why the running hood isn't painted and the buffers weren't painted when the, the coupling the front coupling wasn't painted either. And yeah. Did you have some Well, even if I try putting details on them, but I mean I mean yes, you do have good de some a lot of deep snow or sticker details, but to be fair, I mean, they're not like the originals, and, you know, I really did a comparison video of them, and the only, oh, and you're probably wondering, um, what happened to Timothy's old screw? Yeah, I had to get rid of it, I had to remove it because I had to use my pliers to, well, Yeah, as you can see, I did may or may kind of mess up the front, the chassis a little. And a little bit of the buffer beam. Yeah. But I got him this other screw from my 2014 Playboy Gordon, so yeah. Plus, I might have to, well... We call it a dome of lighter blue, uh, lighter blue. So yeah. Sorry, me having a bit of talking problem. And the second and the third problem is sure it's the couplings on the wheels that are a problem. But it's just a small. It's just the rolling stock is a bit smaller than the original Trackmaster one and Play Rare rolling stock. And 
to be fair, they're a bit too small because they could derail fall off the tracks because even if you try to do that, they'll derail. They'll just fall off the track and probably cause mm. They're way too small and well that's the problem because it's so small. You have to put two at a time because that so that way it would be a bit more easier. And well, yes, there are Oh, and you're wondering why there are two two random Brendan Bay vans is because I had another salty which had a factory error. This is another salty with the correct wheels. But I'm also going to be changing the wheels soon, but like I said, I don't know when. Maybe. Also, the reason why I, I had to get another one because my other one had the error, the factory error, if you're wondering. A bunch of factory errors with them. If you're, if you know them, there's a lot of factory error videos. And I don't know why they gave Gustavo and Raul side rods. Because they don't have side rods. I don't know why, but to be fair. And... I don't know how Freddy and Luke got their Trackmaster 2 releases, but I got them anyway. But it's true because why do they have side rods? And what the bigger question is, why is Maru is Raul's wheels yellow? He has black wheels, not yellow wheels, I guess. And I don't mind Hugo. Oh, right. It was okay. It's kind of cool seeing a propeller in the back, but there's also one small problem. Uh, I may have busted one of the, some, a few of the gears that move the engines, where the motor is. So yeah, they make a really grind up, a clicking and grinding noise whenever they're on the tracks because I also had to replace the gear soon, gears as well. Same with Phillips, he also had a gear issue as well. Yeah, I might have to replace the gears, maybe. I mean, to be fair, I only got... These two Thomases are pretty... are okay. I mean, they look fine, and they don't look that... I mean, I'm okay with the... Both stickers on the sides of them. I mean, apart from the stickers on this one, this one has like 3D printed like lightning colored stri rainbow stripes on it. And on the face too. You can tell from the different facial expressions if you're wondering. Which is weird. Yeah. They even cover this Thomas in this covered in like ash or dust or yeah ash even the wheels I mean I might I well oh yeah and you're probably wondering the other the old side rod kind of yeah but don't worry I mean to be fair I actually had to get one uh, one of my rules so yeah I mean, they look probably fine, but to be fair, I mean, not going to be saying mean things about it, but to be fair, I mean, I would like to replace the coupling someday, like in this truck, some on some of the trucks, but to be fair, I don't know when I'll get, I'll get the chance to do that. And if you're wondering why I uh, repainted the... The Trackmaster 2 Toby is because, well, why I didn't repaint. I mean, I used the black oil-based marker for the roof and the side, and the cow catchers and side plates is because, and the buffers in silver oil-based marker is because, well, I didn't want to look the same as my Tommy Toby, so, yeah. 
I mean, Kenji's okay. That's all I gotta say. He's perfectly fine. But that's just it. Though, I don't mind. The spiral set's a good set. And some of the sets are okay, like the Water Tower, High Flying Rescue, and Spiral set. Well, except the water, the High Flying Rescue set had has an error with that orange piece, the two orange pieces. One of them isn't quite the same as the other one, so that's why. It's also a factory error. I think that's why. So, I guess that's it. I'm not going to say anything mean about this, but to be fair, if any of you guys are having problems with your Trackmaster engines, I mean, if you want to change the couplings, or... And also about the tracks, I don't know, I mean... I, one of my straights actually broke, so... Piece of a straight... One of my tra straight tracks actually broke, so... Yeah. But I don't know why, but... I guess... I guess I'll, I'll guess we'll never know. Also, I mean... I don't hate it, but to be fair, I don't, I mean, it's been like 11 years now, and it's practically, well, no more, and yeah, I guess, though well, it is pretty, well, I mean, you could replace the wheels, but you have to use a vice for that, and I have pliers and a hammer, but that's not important. So, I might you might have to replace the couplings or the and the wheels at some point. I mean, if you have a spare or a broken engine, a broken Trackmaster or Playroll model, I mean you can actually find one on eBay. But to be fair, I guess though it's not that so surprising. Though I don't really hate them. I mean I don't I like this stuff though. But to be f I only put little details on them because they were just didn't have any details when I got them, so I thought it would be a good idea to put details on them, on the rolling stock and engine. So yeah. So I guess that's it. I guess. Though to be fair, I don't usually don't hate it. I don't hate Track Master Two. I mean, I already got my play rail engines and some of the old rolling stock from that line. And well. I guess that's it. I hope you guys understand and and please don't take this seriously. So you guys could ask me about or talk to me about what you thought what your thoughts on Trackmaster 2. Is Trackmaster 1 and Play Rail better? Of course they are, but I mean some of you guys have Trackmaster 2 engines and customs out of them, so yeah. So I hope you guys enjoy, but do ask me in the comments about, or tell me what it, what's your opinion on Trackmaster 2, and I will respond to them. Alright, I guess that's it, and I will see you guys in the next one.